girl Chris Marie back with another video and as you can see from the title we're gonna be reviewing a pregnancy pillow so before I get into the video I want to clear up a couple things from the last video um, that I did some research after I made the video and let's be real guys <laughs> it's kind of hard to edit with the systems I have on my phone and I know like I should just connect it to my laptop but that laptop is more like a notebook laptop so it doesn't have the programs that I need so long story short I didn't bother editing and putting the findings that I found so apparently I'm in my second trimester already um, it is Friday today so tomorrow will be Saturday and I'll be officially 14 weeks um, so Again, I don't know how this pregnancy thing works. Um, all I know is I'm three months and a, I guess a week or so. I don't know. But um, I'm just going to go by that I'm 14 weeks tomorrow. And yeah. So I just wanted to clarify that up because I know in my video I was so sure of what I was. But I really, I really wasn't sure, guys. I just want to put that out there. Um, as far as this week, nothing crazy has been happening. Lately, I am home alone right now. My husband um, is working until 3 in the morning, unfortunately, on a Friday. So I figured why not make this video on something that I did tell you guys I was going to make a video on. This package literally came in like an hour ago, um, and I've been wanting to open it so bad, but I wanted to wait with you guys. So really quick disclaimer. Um, these are my own opinions on this pillow. I know I've got mixed reviews on don't waste your money, it's not worth it to you need it, you like just gonna change your life. Um, again, it's gonna be my own opinions. I'm going to test it out and if it doesn't work out for me, then it doesn't work out for me. I can use it for when I nurse or when the baby gets a little bit bigger. Um, so what I'm going to do is unbox this for you guys. We're going to go ahead and do that all here. Um, and then I'm going to test it out tonight and then tell you guys in the morning the pros and cons on this pillow. So, yeah. I've been so thirsty. You guys, I literally drink like 12 of these a day if not more and I'm not even joking. Okay. Alright, so I'm going to move my cup over there. Okay, so I got some scissors. <sighs> the boys are fighting. Hold on. All right, guys, so I got some scissors, and this is what the box looks like. <clears throat> oh, you can see that it's not heavy, it's just because I'm on the floor sitting down. Um, Feels kind of heavy, I guess. And I know the lighting is like going in and out. Oh, I wish it wouldn't do that. <clears throat> Let's see if that's better. Oh, okay. <laughs> so this is what the box says. And I'm gonna go ahead and unbox this bad boy. Now I did order this on I wanna say I ordered it on Sunday or Monday. And it's Friday, so I think that was fairly quick. It came in from Canada. I got it on Amazon. Um, I literally typed in pregnancy pillow, and I mean, there's so many options. This one costs $37.99 free shipping because of the color of the pillow. If I wanted gray, pink, or any other color, it would have been $40. So I was like, let me save a little bit of money and just get the mint color because I like mint anyway. Oh. And this is what it looks like. My dog is currently trying to now <laughs> play with it. So this is what it looks like. Again, it's the mint color. It's in a C shape. Go ahead. Take it out of this. I don't know how. Ugh. I really hope this works out. That's just my opinion because I just can't get comfortable at all without hugging my husband 
but then he gets way too hot and I can't. I like to be like semi cold. Which is sucky because I'm gonna be pregnant for the summer. So let's see how that goes. All right. So I'm gonna set that to the side over there real quick. I'm gonna go ahead and read what's in the back of this. All right, so on this, this is from Farmy Doc. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Farmy Doc. This is what I got. Um, so this is the brand that I got on Amazon, and in the back, it just—it's like a little description. It tells you how to take care of it. So it says, please allow up to 48 hours after unboxing the pill to reach its full size. Pat and fluff pillow to desired comfort. So, does that mean I can't use it tonight? Because I'm going to. Huh. Yeah, so I cut a little piece of the plastic and it's like already like going. Pfft. It's really, really soft, guys. Really soft. All right, guys, so it's currently 4.35 p.m. right now. Um, I'm not going to go to bed till probably, like, I usually don't go to bed when my husband's at work till, like, 11 o'clock for my own stupid reasons um, because I've been watching a lot of conspiracy theories lately, and, yeah, it's been freaking me out. But, um, so I'm going to try this at 11 o'clock at night. Um, I know it says 40 hours, but let's be real. I've been waiting forever for this thing, so... Not forever, but like you guys get what I mean. I've been dying for this pillow and I don't think I can wait any longer. So I'm gonna let it do its thing till 11 o'clock at night. But if you are getting this pillow and you can wait and not be impatient like me, then wait the full 48 hours. Um, then it says wash cover regularly, inner shell is not machine washable. So the pillow you can't, but that um, green mesh that I have I guess comes off oh yeah it comes I can feel it when I pull it it comes off so it's just a case over the pillow so really you can technically get any pillowcase cover for this I mean if you find like the pregnancy pillowcases but I don't know if Amazon sells those separately I'm pretty sure they do if they do comment down below let me know because I mean if I could change this then I will um, then it says exposed to sunlight to ward off dust mites and bacteria. This damn pillow, I swear to God. Okay, so now it also says share your experience if you're happy. If you're unhappy, they have a phone number and an email that you can contact, which is awesome. Um, it tells you different ways that you can use the pillow as the belly bumper, which elevates the knees while hugging the belly and providing soft support for your arms. The solo sleeper provide, bleh, provides head, neck, and leg support while easing your hips into an aligned and comfy position. I think I'll be using that one. Taking it kneesy, which is optimum leg and knee support, customized to your desired height by curling, decurling the swirl. And the bookworm, which is head and neck support, props you up and forms a snug spot to rest your tablet or book, which I might be using that one too because I've been reading like a lot of uh, my Greek mythology books there. So I really like this. Hmm. To show you guys the pictures. So it's really cute and it has all the contact information. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and finish. Ugh, now I got heavy. Ripping this off. Just keeps growing on me. This thing. This thing is huge. You know what this reminds me of? You know the boyfriend pillow thing? Like this. This only reminds me of it because my best friend literally just posted about that. I think it was yesterday. So, but um, it's really, really soft. Like, look at that. It has a weird smell to it. 
I don't know if it's because it was in the factory. It's like a weird smell. Like it's not a bad smell, but it's like the pillow smell like that. I don't know. Um, so yeah, I'm going to leave this on my bed and then when I go to sleep tonight, I'm gonna test it out. And then in the morning, I will tell you guys how my pros and cons are. Again, this is just my opinion. This is not, you know, any way, shape, or form saying if I don't agree, don't get this pillow. Or if I agree, get the pillow. This is just my opinion. You're probably wondering what the hell am I doing. Um, I'm actually looking for the zipper because I don't see. Oh, oh okay. Very discreetly right here. There's a zipper. And inside is the white pillow. Yeah, it's got like a weird smell. It's not bad, but then again, everything smells bad when you're pregnant. At least for me right now. God, I can't stand like the most weird things. All right, guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and place this pillow on my bed, and then you'll see me next time tomorrow reviewing how I thought the pillow was. But before I go, I do want to show you the actual length of this pillow because it's freaking huge. This was the original pillow I was using. It's just a huge body pillow. So I'll let it lay next to it, tuck that under. And that was not really working out for me. I mean, I used this for when I got sick really bad um, to help me elevate my head for all the leakage. I know I'm breathing heavy, guys. I'm sorry. To elevate my head for all the leakage from all the congestion I had in the ear infection. Um, but after that, that pill didn't get much use. Um, but this is the pillow. You can see. It's, it's, it's gigantic. You ask me so I'm gonna let it do its thing I mean I think it's it's full effect to be honest um, and yeah so I'm obviously gonna lay it on this side that's where I lay and remove those back pillows because from the videos I've watched it says to lay on this without pillows um, so yeah hopefully <laughs> I'm praying guys this works out yeah another quick tip if smells are bothering you like they are for me we got this at Walmart it's pretty much like a wax melter there's a light bulb in there and um, the scents come out and originally this was actually in the living room and I put it in my room because my husband's uniform smells straight up like fuel and pregnancy knows I can smell literally everything he did the day on the base so I can't stand the smells anymore it's bothering me um, and this actually helps out a lot. Right now I have a cinnamon vanilla one in there. And I usually hate the smell of vanilla on candles. But it's actually making the room smell really good. No, sorry, cinnamon spice. But um, it's actually making the room smell really, really good. And I just leave it on for a little bit. And then I turn it off and do my thing. So, yeah. All right, guys. See you in the morning. Not only did my husband come early, home early from work. But... <laughs> I haven't guys I haven't even tried this pillow out yet it did grow a little more from the last time I showed you guys it's more firm now but um yeah I haven't even tried this pillow out yet and he's full-blown okay but you're not sleeping with that tonight oh my god all right guys, so it's currently the morning. It's like 8.20 something or whatever. Um, obviously I just woke up, I have bags. Um, and my hair is a little wonky. Um, so my pros and cons on the pillow behind me. All right, so pros, it's very, very, very comfortable. Um, I love the support it pushes on my stomach. It feels like if I'm hugging my husband because that's what I was doing for a while. Um, but like I said earlier, he just gets too, too, too hot and not for it. <laughs> um, another pro is that the pillow is just overall comfortable. Like I literally feel like I'm getting hugged everywhere, my butt everywhere. Now with that being said, there is a con. 
because this pillow is really huge. So the con with um, that is that I'm getting like hugged. And I know I just said that's a pro, but it's also a con because it's just, I, it's kind of overwhelming. Um, another con that I will say on that note is because it's big and I'm kind of on the shorter side, I guess. I'm like 5'4". I'm like average, but um, it's hard to find the right position. Um, so at first, when I put on the bed, I removed my pillows, I laid down, I was laying in the middle section of the seat. So I was laying in the middle part, and I guess your head's supposed to be at the top. So I moved the pillow, and it's just like, it's like the, the, the number one con is that you have to find the right position for this pillow because if not, you're going to be searching for it, I guess. I, I don't know if that makes any sense, but um, yeah, would I recommend this pillow? Of course I would. It was only $37.99, free shipping. Um, I love the pillow. Another con um, was I was worried the whole entire night. I did sleep more. But I was also waking up a little bit more than usual. Um, well, no, I was waking up a little less than usual. But when I was waking up, it was because of the fact that um, I had, so I had the long part towards the edge of the bed because the pillow was taking up room, and my husband was getting annoyed, and um, so I was, I moved it to the edge, but the pillow kept falling. So it's just finding that right balance of making sure you're not taking your significant other space with the pillow and um, yeah, I mean we have a queen size bed but with that pillow it feels like we're laying on a twin so yeah, um, we are upgrading to a king size bed. We're just looking at a couple reviews on a couple mattresses. I know one of them was like a purple mattress we were looking at and whatnot but for the time being, we have our queen mattress, and this kind of takes up a lot of room. So that's another thing to be mindful when getting this pillow. If you have like a full size or twin, I meant to say the bed feels like a full size, not twin. Um, if you have a full size or whatever size you have, and you have your partner on there, and you have blankets, and you have pillows, you're gonna have to cut down on some of this stuff because between you being pregnant and then a body pillow like this it feels like there's someone else in the bed with you so just be mindful that's like one of the cons that sucks about the pillow but my husband as you guys saw earlier loves the pillow so I know the pillow will get used if I'm not using it and then I did come over to the couch early this morning when we took Cooper out because he has to wake everybody up at 7 in the morning and <laughs> That's Cooper chasing after this sale. But, um, so I did come over to the couch and I laid on the couch and you guys, I knocked out. Like, I knocked out with my pillow. So I'm very excited that at least I know not only can I use it on the bed, but like when I'm in the living room watching the dogs um, and making sure they're not causing havoc or trying to get on the couch. And I usually like taking my naps on the couch, so I love that I can use this pillow on the couch. And even though you see all those big pillows, they weren't in the way they actually helped my back support. Um, speaking of back support, I also did try the pillow reversed. So I put the long, like I put the C backwards. So I put the curvature where my head was and then the long part behind me and then wrap under and in, in between my legs and you guys it felt it felt amazing because I felt like I was being swaddled and I love that feeling however my belly did not feel amazing um, right away I could tell the difference um, that that little subtle pressure that I like on my belly to help relieve like I don't know what it's relieving like tension or whatever um, it was gone and I was like searching for blanket or my husband and all automatically I was like yeah I I need this pillow like it, it's crazy so those are my thoughts
all right guys so obviously my opinions are my own um like I said, I do recommend this pillow. However, it is totally on you. Um, you guys did see that I was trying to use a body pillow. It didn't work out for me. Um, from Walmart, that pillow cost $35, I believe. I didn't tell you the price on that one. So I spent around the same amount of money for this pillow as the body pillow. Um, a little bit of, of that body pillow because I realized I didn't even mention like, um, the pros and cons I guess on that um, the con was it's just too puffy and I, I it's too like because it's so puffy it's so um, broad and like defined as a rectangle so it doesn't really like give you that comfort um, but the pro on it is I love the cold I love the cold even before pregnancy and the pillow has some type of mechanism that um when you lay on it it releases like kind of like a, like your pillow is always cold pretty much so i love that like that was what sold me on that pillow um my husband uses that pillow we still have it on our bed sometimes i'll put my feet on it or sometimes i'll like put it on my back to support myself sitting up in bed um so the pillow does get used it's just it wasn't helping with um, giving me that support sleeping at night so again these are my opinions i hope you guys um i hope this was useful for you guys uh again um i would say read reviews and you know trial and error um and i believe you can return this too like i said there was the card that had information that you can return if you don't if you're not happy with it um, I was happy despite of the few cons that I had but I mean those can get like easily um, fixed over time and I'm pretty sure over time as I get bigger I'm going to absolutely love this pillow um, and this pillow is gonna get used even after pregnancy so I'm not worried about it um, but yeah those are my reviews and I hope you guys like this video the dogs are like eating right there so if it sounds loud i'm so sorry um but until next time guys thank you so much for watching my video and i will see you guys next week and comment down below any suggestions if you bought the pillow if you bought another brand if it did or did not work out for you comment down below i would love to know like you know the different aspects of what different people went through and all that and oh by the way today is saturday so i'm officially 14 weeks guys <laughs> Alright, enough talking. I'm going to go make some breakfast. Have a good day, guys. Bye.